Got a John Deere Auto Power IVT for ILS. This came out of an 8360R with the IVT. It'll fit a ton of tractors as long as it has the IVT. This is a non-front PTO that can be converted to a PTO if you have that. Had a little fire, or had a cab fire, so it had some fire down on the front of the transmission. We pulled the front cover, did all the OEM checks inside. Cleaned the front cover, reinstalled it. So no solenoids on this one. You'll need to use your solenoids. So using your solenoids, you'll need to make sure you use the OEM procedure to clean the solenoids out so you don't contaminate anything. You also need to make sure if you have contamination in your system from brake material, bearing material, anything like that, that you flush your system prior to installing any transmission, no matter if it's a brand new deer, when they send it in for warranty, and you didn't, or they didn't flush it, it's probably gonna be some issues. So we always encourage someone to protect their investment. Do a good flush. Clean your FEMA valves out before you reinstall. We just figured this tractor was a 2014 model. We had it, it's been on the lot for a while. We just now gotten around to tearing it down. So we assume it had about 2,500 hours on it. Good use transmission, 12 month part warranty, optional labor warranty, make you feel better. We do pay just flat rate to swap it in and out. So we can help you out, let us know.